life isn't fair and it can be heart-wrenching. Don't give up. Don't give up. Stay in it. Stay focused. And if you're having one of those dark days, it's okay. It's okay. Sometimes horrible things happen to good people. Look for the lesson in it all. You will grow through what you go through. The question is, are you willing to go through it? You cannot make a person happy. You can make a person smile, you can make a person feel good, you can make a person laugh, but whether or not a person is happy, is deeply and totally and utterly out of your control. What makes you get up when you fall down? Why do you keep going? What makes your mentality change if there's a great situation or there's a bad situation? How do you dictate that based off the level of pain? I remember the day um, I retired. I literally said to Jada, that's it. I retire from trying to make you happy. I need you to go make yourself happy and just prove to me that it's even possible. Step up to the challenge, no matter what you face. Start walking. Take that step. When those bad things happen, what are you going to do? Are you going to let this horrible situation dictate the way you feel and the way you handle it? Are you going to fall over, fall down? fall apart? Are you going to face this issue with courage and with resolution? You know darkness. So embrace, embrace that darkness. Don't look away from it. Own it. When you're thinking about giving up, don't. When you feel like giving up, don't. When it look like you ain't gonna make it, keep going. When they tell you you're not gonna make it, don't believe them, man. When they tell you you can't, come on, man, who are they? Don't believe them. You got to be relentless. So however you step, just step. However you step, just step. Sometimes you got to step out of something before you're stepping into something. Just step. Don't get paralysis of the analysis trying to make sure the step is right. I'd rather you take 10 steps wrong than analyze trying to make one step right. One more day while someone's waiting to be inspired by you. But you can choose in the midst of all of this that's going on to be happy in spite of life's challenges. The bottom line the choice. You have the choice to fight. You have the choice to quit. So you got to look yourself in the mirror and ask yourself, what are you going to do with the most powerful tool that you have? When you get knocked to the ground, you can choose to stay down there, play the victim, or you can choose to get back to your feet. Go back to fight hard and do what you got to do to make the cut and reach your goal. Choice is a powerful tool.